unfortunately what happened a couple days ago was there was a lightning strike, started a fire, and now there is smoke everywhere. Today we're in Glacier National Park in the great state of Montana. This majestic park encompasses more than one million acres and is the only national park that crosses over to Canada. We are here with photographer Armando Flores as he tries to capture this vast landscape. You can barely make out the ridge of the mountains right there. There's so much smoke. I came with one expectation in my mind and I was dealt with a totally different set of cards. If I'm put into a condition where there's just not much color that is really visible, I start thinking at this point at everything in black and white. Well, I see these dead trees right here, and I'm trying to get a contrast of the tree against the uh, smoke in the background. We continued to explore the park and stopped at Wild Goose Island Overlook. Great conditions, huh? Wind, fire. Smoke all over the place. Black and white it is. When you're at a popular park, uh, it's, it's gonna be very difficult for you to be there by yourself. So sometimes you, you can and should incorporate a human element. Uh, I think it adds to the picture. Due to the fires, there were a lot of road closures. So we had to take a longer way around. Uh, this brought us to this particular spot uh, where the wind was blowing at a different direction, clearing uh, some of the smoke from the mountains that were in front of us. Using the 50 millimeter lens, I was able to incorporate a lot more of the scene. The detail in the clouds, the sun, uh, and all of the lingering smoke down in the lower part of the mountains. We were driving down the road and what caught my eye was the layering in the mountains once again. But once I got out of the car, I saw that there was a lot more to this picture. Try to get a little bit of the meandering river there uh, with a little bit of uh, glare on it. Uh, some of the layerings up in the mountains uh, and then the dead uh, pine trees peeking out through the, uh, through the live ones. I exposed for the highlights knowing that I would be able to bring out the detail in the shadows. I set my aperture to f22 because I wanted to create a sunburst. Two Medicine is an iconic glacier location and I couldn't get over how crisp and clear the water was. However, the peak is being obscured by a lot of smoke at this time. So even though this was a surreal location with majestic mountains all around it, I kept thinking to myself, the, the conditions aren't right. So I had one last idea of my sleep, and I decided to come back that night. I'm using the Tamron 15 to 30 2.8 G2. So the next time you're traveling and the conditions aren't ideal, don't get discouraged. Keep shooting, take chances, and embrace the unexpected. <laughs>